Yes, the Canyon Purple Fools came out today. I was able to hit on uh, Hibbit's raffle, and I'm here going and pick them up. And we're going to see what we have inside. Y'all check out what's on the feet. Got on some fours to pick up the fours. Yes, guys, just left out of Hibbit. I wanted to vlog inside, but... The music was entirely too loud and now they won't get copyrighted. But we have them right here to pick up the Jordan Full Canyon Purples. Uh, I had a review on these already. Let's see what else we can get into today. Yes, yeah, guys, now we back at the spot. Uh, Y'all saw me picked up the uh, Canyon Purples from Hibbit. Uh, like I said earlier, I had an early review on them. Y'all saw the box. Yeah, I picked up a pair. And for those of you guys that haven't seen them before, these are the sneakers that I picked up. These are the Canyon Purples. Nice sneaker. I wanted to vlog in the store because there was some really good items in there that I liked. And I managed to pick up a few things. And I'm going to uh, show them to you guys. Uh, another bag from Hibbits. One of the items I picked up was this Phoenix Suns hat. Very nice hat and it's almost a match for the King Purpose. Let's put that up to it. Right there. How y'all like that? To kind of rock that together. But I did pick up this hat. There was some great finds in that Hibbit. And look at the price, it was half price, plus I got money off of it due to my Hibbert rewards. I love shopping at Hibbert. If you can uh, give me any type of rewards or reward me for shopping with you, that is my kind of store. The nice Hallwood Classic Phoenix hat, and of course the seven and a half fitted. That's all your boy rock is the fitted hats. The uh, next item I picked up was this Jordan T. And these are all on the clearance rack. Nice Jordan T. Another clearance rack item. Half price off. Front and back. Nice little Jordan T. You know, sometimes you gotta shop in reverse. Shop out of season. I know we are coming to a cooler part of the year, but you know I can play that next summer. Got another tee. This was a new tee. This was not on the clearance rack, but I kind of like this. Play this with a couple items that I have. The Jordan Fools to be specific. To rock these with the black canvas. Jordan Fools that recently released. Also, you could rock them with the... Uh, the bread for us, but kind of like this shirt. Had to pick that up. And what's another shirt that I picked up? Oh, yeah. This one is a long sleeve tee. Go again. Another Jordan 4. Now, fly. Let's see what this on the sleeve is. Oh, it says jump, man. Jump man, nice little tee. And this was on a yep, on a clearance rack as well. And there's something on the other sleeve. Nice little long sleeve tee. Perfect for Louisiana weather because it doesn't necessarily get cold out here. It just get cool. Here you go, see it's air Jordan. It's kind of broken off. And nothing on the back. But I love shopping at Hibbit. I be finding some good steals in Hibbit. So let me know what y'all think of today's video and the pickups I had today with the Canyon Full Purples, the Jordan Full Canyon Full Purples. How did the release go in your city? Because uh, pairs were kind of rare to touch locally for a lot of people. A lot of people were looking for those sizes. Especially the uh, big 
extended sizes like I wear. That's why when I saw that price getting right, because remember, overseas kept their original release date and uh, they were sitting. So I, I purchased my pair. I got my pair for about 270 ship. And now my size, that size 15 in that shoe, it's like $450. So that was a really smart buy on my part. That was a great deal. So, uh, so guys, let me know if you were able to pick up the Canyon Full Purpose in your city because the sneakers app, that release was horrible on the sneakers app. But like a lot of people keep saying, you cannot depend on sneakers to get these sneakers. If you're waiting on the sneakers app to get a sneaker, you're probably gonna miss out because the sneakers app is cannot be your only resort. You have to do the leg work. You have to put in the leg work, go in these stores in your cities, make friends with these people, buy items. It doesn't necessarily have to be a hype release. Or I mean, it could be something like a T-shirts, things like this. People remember your face. Trust me, with a name like I have. It gonna remember me so you buy items like this and it leads to you getting items like this so it's not always about the hype release if you frequent the store and they keep seeing you coming in there and you buying stuff you helping them by move stuff that the uh, resellers aren't buying or people aren't buying you helping them move product the more product they move, that's the more product they can uh, get in. So when they get all the hype releases and you've been buying all the regular items from them, they're going to remember you and it may look out for you. It may work for you, may not. Just a suggestion, but that's my word for the day and I'm going to let y'all go. And like I always tell you, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get their sneaker because you never know. But it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Fee Jack, signing out.